All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of uh, Project Zomboid Zombified. And the reason I'm on the map screen is because I want you guys to understand what happened. I had um, my last episode for Zombified was the Resident Evil Mansion Fort I was going to start building. But I think a day or so after that, they updated uh, Project Zomboid. And I was, you know, busy playing another part, uh, another save that I have that has no mods. And uh, basically now there's uh, no mods that I can find that actually work without having, you know, problems inside of the game. So my the main mod that I like to use all the time, the uh, Realistic Kentucky Firearms mod, has uh, uh, quite a few bugs where you can't chop down trees, certain menus don't work, uh, you know, which is a major, which, which is major bugs in Project Zomboid. If you can't cut down trees, you basically uh, can't play the game, you know, so basically i had to um start a new zombified save game in uh bedford falls but um they spawned me up here they spawned me actually in this little uh house right here so i spawned here and right now i'm standing out here on the street here and there's zombies everywhere of course but uh the resident evil mansion is here <laughs> so basically on the other side of the entire map and the way that i have to go to it is extremely dangerous i mean i've played this map many 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 times and it's this these parts of the the map especially these houses neighborhoods this hotel the downtown part this is like the most dangerous part of the map there's the most zombies and everything so i just want to give you guys a heads up of why things are going to be different because i know the last time you saw a zombie fight episode we were actually in the resident evil mansion uh you know waiting to start building up and start doing stuff there so it's gonna take me a little uh, uh maybe an episode or two to actually get back to the resident evil mansion safely uh, i'm gonna try to uh you know stop by a few places that i've actually never been on this map before like this uh military building here and a couple other buildings on the way back and then i'm definitely gonna hit the um hardware store and all these things over here before we actually go back so we're we're kind of gonna take this path here down maybe back around this block uh, circle around come back through this way and then we'll head across this way and then we'll go down we'll try to avoid the downtown area which you you really really want to um avoid that at any cost you know uh, the downtown area especially for right now so let's get back into the game and let's start this little journey because I'm basically I have a baseball bat a backpack a little bit of food a couple bottles of water and a kitchen knife which I'm using the kitchen knife now uh, you know what let's try to go in this house and forge a little bit more food I think he saw us oh no oh damn it broke the knife yeah, the knife is really sucky. It only lasts for a little bit of time. Let's go ahead and drop that. Duct tape, glue, scotch tape. I'm not going to worry about that. Let's just get rid of it. We'll put this in both hands. All right. Let's see if we can get in this house and grab some uh, food or something, anything. This is going to be a hard journey to get back down there. Uh, I've actually only spawned at this part of the uh, city uh, maybe two times, so bear with me on trying to get back down there I, I normally uh have never made it this far on just having to go search for you know search for, uh is this house empty oh man yeah i've actually never made it back that uh, made it up this far in this neighborhood you know uh just rambling around looking for stuff and exploring so this is all new to me so let's try to ease on down here we'll try to duck in a few of these houses maybe if we have to Damn it. Oh. Alright, so I'm making too much noise now with all the running. It's going to draw the zombies. Uh, I'm going to cut around this side house right here. Alright. I need to lose the horde, so let's go ahead and maybe go through this house yes alright we'll grab some stuff out of here grab this 
this and the bottles of water. Alright, so let's see what else we can find just quickly here. We know we got some company knocking at the door, so we're not going to stay too long. I think I already have a hammer. Yeah, I already have a hammer, so I don't need that. We'll definitely take the chips and the chocolate. More chocolate. I know. I, oh, is that a pistol? Let's go ahead and grab all this ammo, chips, and that pistol. No, I saw a pistol there. There we go. There we go. Let's grab this. Definitely want to take that. And we will take the TV dinner just to have us some food to hold us over. All right, let's cut through the house and just go. Ooh. Books. Don't need any of that right now. Fill up the water bottle before we go. Drink. Alright, let's see if we can sneak out. Get around these guys. Yeah, I saw this uh, military building that said it was on the map, so I want to definitely try to check that out. But I don't want to get caught off in the woods with a horde of zombies coming. That is not ideal, so we got to be extra careful here. I believe the military building should be right around here. So let's just get rid of her. We don't need her following us, drawing more zombies. Okay, damn, die. I always have the hardest time killing the female zombies. They take like 20 hits to kill sometimes. It makes no sense. Hey, damn, like 10 times I had to hit that zombie. The female zombies should not be that tough. Okay, damn. Alright. Hopefully this military building is right in this area. Which I looked it up on the map and it's supposed to be... Here? Oh, this looks like a store. I think it's this building up here. Yeah, I think that's it see if we can get in here. Damn it. Dog barking in the game? Alright, let's grab some of this food. Nothing but chips. Alright, what do we got here? Definitely gonna take the soda. Yeah, I was uh, real upset about my save game, but that's what it is. it is. What it is when you're dealing with a uh, a game that isn't done yet, you have to accept your losses for your hard work. It's just a uh, man. Don't even get me started on my KSP game. You know, man, it is just crazy that game. It, it has so many mods, and so many people have to update their mods just to keep your save game going. You might as well not even. You know, especially when they're pumping out um, updates faster than some of the guys can actually update their mods, which is crazy, but, alright. That should be enough. We'll go next door. We don't want to overload ourselves this early on when we have so far to go. Alright, make sure there's no zombies around. It's getting pretty late. We might try to find somewhere to stay here. Hopefully we'll find something in this military building. Come on. I don't want to break this window. Even though I might be... Okay, here we go. Alright, let's see what we have in here. Okay, so... A book. Brick toys, cigarettes. Alright, so it's basically like, what, a barracks out in the middle of nowhere? Ah, at least should find a gun or something. This is a military building. Oh, man. So nothing. Pens and papers, baseball bats, which I already have. Mm, 
nothing so this is basically stopping here was probably going to be pointless because apparently these military guys have no guns alright what do we got here nothing 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 damn it so this was absolute waste of time let's go down here and check this other door I think I checked this one yep check that one already let's see what's in here probably the bathroom yep alright forget this let's go we gotta find somewhere to crash for the night he's hungry he's tired this building looks pretty boarded up looks like somebody tried to make it into something a base maybe I might be able to find somewhere to sleep in here need to saw we're gonna need that so that's a good find that's definitely a good find there Let's see what we have over here then we'll try to find somewhere to sleep I'm not gonna make a long episode today because I'm really kind of PO that I already did quite a bit of work and, and set up work just for it to be screwed off by the damn update or the mod not actually working and you know I love the realistic Kentucky firearms mod I mean it has so many uh, extra things added to it not just guns you know so I don't know I don't really feel safe in this big ass warehouse I'm gonna find somewhere else okay so I can't must be boarded up or something I can't get out alright let's see we need to find somewhere to stay as quickly as possible anywhere is good office bit no we're not sleeping in an office building no that's gonna be dangerous Let's see, stores, stores. Let's try to head this way. Hope we don't run into a horde. Right, so, uh, this is not looking good. These are garages. No house, no houses, anything. Yeah, so this is going to be a. A little journey to get back over to the Resident Evil mansion. Okay, you're hungry, you're tired, you're depressed. I know, I know, man. It's hard out here trying to survive in the zombie apocalypse, my friend. But you gotta suck it up. In fact, let's go ahead and eat you some food. Let's eat some uh, chocolate. That'll boost you up. Alright, we definitely need to find somewhere to sleep, though, because he's getting really tired. Is there a chair in there? Yeah, but, uh, damn it. I need somewhere to sleep. Alright, looks like we're getting some houses up here. Garage, probably no good. No. Alright. We'll sleep in one of these chairs in this place here. I'll probably call this episode here and, and try to get it out here for you guys today. Just an update. Come on, man. Yeah, because I've been really busy on my uh, super map, uh, you know, series. So I haven't really been playing my zombified because the saves were all messed up and I didn't want to start all over again. So I've been procrastinating, but I know I really like my zombified series. It was one of my earlier first series that I started. Let's go ahead and go to sleep. We'll sleep here. Get him all rested up. He's freezing his ass off. We need a sweater or something. Yeah, but I've been busy on all these other series, especially a lot of new games that I'm coming out. But I'm definitely going to get uh, more videos out of my Project Zomboid. It's one of my favorite games. So, um, this is just going to be a, like an update uh, video for Zombified. And uh, hope you uh, guys keep on watching. We'll make it back to the Resident Evil Mansion and get back to where we, st uh, where we uh, intentionally, you know, uh, originally tried to start doing something different. Maybe building a mega fort. But I'm definitely not going to do it in this area of uh, Bedford Falls. This is just not my area. Uh, so um, thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Hope to see you next time. Goodbye.